Howdy, y'all. Joe Hills here, recording as I was doing in Nashville, Tennessee. And as you can tell, Python GB has just left the game after restocking the Shulker Box stop shop to the brim. Now, I don't remember exactly where this shop is located, but I do know that it sells out immediately every time it's stocked. I do not have any Shulker Boxes, so this is my first and only chance, maybe, to get any. Let's go ahead and hop in here. Oh, no. Wait, did I... Am I really that low on diamonds? Okay. One box for eight diamonds, two for fifteen. Oh, no. Okay. Dang it. Dang it, dang it, dang it. I'm so broke. Well, I, th I think I can use just one. I don't think I need two. So let's just go ahead and grab the first eight here. Dang it. Two for fifteen isn't really that good of a discount anyway. You know what? Let's see if we can get three diamonds in the next few minutes. Because if we can get just a few more diamonds, then I think that it's fair to consider that kind of the same purchase. But we got to be super quick about it. So let's run over here real quick to our shop. Check if we've sold anything. Maybe we have, maybe we have not. Big money, big money, big money. Nope. Dang it, okay. Okay, so no sales, that's fine. That's fine. Um, our previous sales got us to 13. So maybe, maybe we got some extra diamonds lying around down here underneath the art gallery. How many torches do I have? 15. That's not a lot of torches. How much wood do I have? Not much. Do I have any diamonds in any of these chests? Dang it. Ooh, there's some wood, though. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. We're going on a very rapid adventure. Before False Symmetry, who is also logged on, runs over to the shulker box shop and buys all of them because she's gonna... Okay. So we gotta go pretty far down on the server to get to the diamond level. But luckily for me, I knew there was this ravine here. So, okay, time is a factor. Looks like somebody's lit up this side of it, but not this side. Which is why there's creepers and stuff. So there's kind of like half of one thing, something of another. Um, hey creeper. At least he's not a skeleton. Or a zombie. Okay, that zombie can't hit us from there. We gotta hit the creeper, though, before he hops on us. Should have made sure for certain the creeper was dead first, but whatever. Additional torches to deter the spawning of such creatures as may rain down upon our heads like such thunderous clouds that they cloud our very own judgment, our self-same minds destroyed. Let's see. What Z level are we at? 15, 14. But our Y level is 14. That's, a, that's good. That's where we want to be. Okay, torch, 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 torch. Quickly looking for diamonds. Exposed diamonds on the walls. I don't really want to dig too much because I don't exactly uh, like branch bonding too much in the middle of a video. Dang it. How dare you? How dare you not have diamonds? Come on. Just striking and punching randomly through walls. We're at the right level for them. Whoa. Okay, gotta keep this in mind. So there's a, a cave down here. Do I see any diamonds in this cave? Dang it. A lot of lava lying around. Ew, gravel too. Okay. Well, let's keep going. We are in a race against false symmetry. At least she's asleep right now, so she might not be actively. Let's grab this gold too, just in case. It'd be silly to not grab gold that might have diamonds behind them, you know. Why not? Okay, so, continuing this way. Quickly now, quickly. Okay, we're gonna go ahead. A lot of cobble here. So this used to be lava, I wonder. I know we're going upward, not downward, but that's more to stop creatures from jumping on us than anything. I know I'm not gonna find diamonds up there. But I do know that if I'm in one of the only dark places on the server left, I will be set upon or beset even by such terrified mobs as might rack my brains. So, here we go. There's some gold lying around on the ground. No diamonds. Diamond, diamond, diamond. To be so singularly minded might not be an advantage at this point, but, okay, so... So this part has a torch here, so in theory... Someone already knows if there is, dang it, um, diamonds over here. And if so, they probably already grabbed them. Dang it. 
torches. Oh, that's a mob spawner. Hope we are not in range. We are in range of that. Okay, so let's go back out this way. Okay, so we got some redstone here. Might as well grab that. Basically, there's no penalty to mining out valuable things other than the loss of time. Time, that most valuable resource. If only uh, Python GB were willing to accept minutes, hours, or even days in exchange for his shulker boxes. Come on. Am I even at the right Z level? Yeah. And I'm at the right Y level as well. For Lapis... Is this other pick faster? It might not be. Dang it. Okay, we found another lava pool here. Any chance of any diamonds visible nearby or throughout? We got additionally exposed faces here. It's a good place to find stuff. Oh, looks like that might turn around there. Let's see what way that goes. It's hard to tell if that's lit by lava or lit because somebody's already been over there, but we'll do our best to investigate. Okay, there may be mobs here. Let's not get knocked immediately into lava. Iron, coal, dang it. Redstone, I mean, redstone's always fun, but it's not diamonds. It's not currency. Diamonds show your fasts to me. I'm at Joe Hills. Diamonds show your facets to me. I'm at Joe Hills. Okay, so this is a waterway here. That might have been dug by a pla Okay, this might be important. Yeah, this looks like it's important. Um, let's not get driven into the sea there. Okay, we're going to just kind of wall that up for right now. Okay, so that's... Whatever that is, that's its own thing. We don't want to break into that. Okay. Great, so we're finding secret underground things that probably lead to other secret underground things. So I can't dig that way anymore. Uh, let's continue this way. At this point, I have too many extra blocks. i got to get rid of some of the dead weight. Okay, I'm just seeing now via my telephone, Python has just informed the entire server that the Shulker Box store has been refilled. So we're probably going to see a lot of people logging on in the next, like, minute and a half. So this is where, like, Isuma Money Bags is going to show up, and Iskul Coin Pants, or whatever. And maybe Tango Tech Dollar Socks something. I don't know. Dang it. Okay, now I'm back here. Come on, money. I really want to build stuff with these shulker boxes, because I don't actually know what they do yet. And how am I going to make an episode about something that I could look up in the Minecraft wiki without, like, knowing what it does? Dang it. Man, I'm collecting a lot of other ore, at least. Like, a lot of my resources had almost been depleted, so this is nice. I won't need to use, uh, uh, what do you call it, diamonds to buy coal anytime soon, on the plus side. Bada bing, here we are, finally. I've already run out of torches and started doubling back. I was just like going through and branch mining off off of each of these torches that I'd already expended. Whoops, probably should like close that up. But like, yeah, I've come a long way. And here we are, finally discovering some diamonds. We're going to go ahead and use our fortune pickaxe on these. Yeah, let's see what we got here. 16, excellent. Diamond pickaxe. Make sure that there's no other, like, hidden diamonds somewhere. Sometimes, like, a diamond vein might move diagonally. Okay, no, good. Well, we are going to get right out of here. So, let's do the running home again. Hopefully I can find it, my friends. My name is Joe Hills, and I am troubled by the fact that my path might be 
redoubled. Who's the guy who can conquer death? That's Joe Hills. He plays for Nashville when he plays Minecraft. That's Joe Hills. Who's the guy who runs underground? That's Joe Hills. He avoids all the mobs, so when he can't be found, that's Joe Hills. That's Joe Hills. Okay, so this should lead us back to our original entry chamber here, if I'm not crazy. Which I haven't ruled out entirely. I might actually be crazy. Okay, wait, no, the actual entrance chamber was back up this way. Man, I took a dangerous path to get here. Might be easier... Well, I really don't want to fall in, in the lava with my shulker box and my stack of diamonds. Well, not really a stack, but you know what I mean. Okay, we are almost home free. I hear a zombie somewhere. Okay, I'm not sure exactly where we are, but let's go ahead and hop out. Good enough. Okay, back to the shulker s spot real quick. Let's see. Fastest route there is probably going to be to take the uh, kind of... We're going to use False Symmetry's own trail against her. Hopefully getting back there before False does. And we have made it back to Python's box of shulkers. Seriously, I've been sprinting like crazy for the last 35 minutes. And you know what? It turns out that nobody else, nobody else even rushed over here. You know what? That's okay. I'm going to leave my, my, what do you call this? 15 and 8 diamonds. I'm going to take my three purple shulker boxes, which I think... I think you can dye these different colors. I don't even know what you can do with these, actually. I think that... Whoa. Okay, well, we're not going to step on that again. Um, I think you can use them to, like, move items or something somehow. I don't know. Put them in mine carts. I'm not the expert on these. But let's run these back to my house and hoard them so that we can uh, experiment with them later. Whew. And we have made it safely back to my field of dreams, my greatest plains. We're just going to come in here real quick. And you know what? I don't know. If I put these on the ground, I don't even know if I can pick them up again safely. Whoa. There's no way to like. That's so cool. So if I put diorite in here and then I pick it up. Okay, good. That didn't like. Dude, wait, can I put this into this chest now? No, not, well, yeah, I can. There's one slot open. So then I come back. Oh, it says Diorite X12 in there. Okay, that's, that's going to be pretty handy. I think, I think I'm going to, I'm going to enjoy having some of these around. So that is excellent. Well, thank you guys so much for joining me on my magical mining adventure. Until next time, y'all, this is Joe Hills from Nashville, Tennessee. Keep adventuring.